A cold front is currently making its passage through the Cowboy State and along that frontal system, especially with it coming in those overnight dark hours where temperatures can get a bit cooler. We are noting that it is going to lead to even some spots seeing some light snowfall coatings, especially in some higher elevational areas, maybe seeing some snowflakes down to the surface levels, but melting on contact as well as then keeping temperatures a bit cooler here for our Friday. The good news is, is that a sunny rebound will quickly take hold on Saturday take advantage of this day as what we see is that quickly into our Sunday we will feel changes it's still going to stay mild and changes aren't going to be high impacts however starting on Monday into Tuesday we could have some high impacts when it comes down to precipitation as well as the wind and we'll take a look at that wind impact in just a moment but here for our Friday we are starting off the day with temperatures around or below that freezing mark and a high 49 so we're staying well below our averages especially afternoons but morning temperatures temperatures again cool enough to allow for potentially some snowflakes. Now again, snow is going to be definitely more prominent higher elevation points. But what we note is that with this type of air mass, the type of, of the timing that it's coming, there could definitely be a few little coated areas of some snow showers as that frontal system continues to push its way through. We'll note that the system really starts to fall apart by midday, by afternoon we even start to see that the lingering showers dissipate and then we should have clear skies overnight Saturday that will take us or overnight Friday that will take us into to our Saturday. When it comes down to precipitation accumulation, it is very minimal. We can see the reflectivity is very light. We're only showing a few hundredths of an inch. And when it comes down to snowfall with that type of moisture, it is very, very limited. So again, not expecting any big impacts, more just going to be a cool spring day where we battle some of just it feels like we should have experienced this last month, not in the month of May, but we'll get through it quickly. That's the good news. So uh, across the state, we are looking anywhere from about 40s to those 50s so everyone feeling really the same good news about friday no wind so that won't add too much of a chill in the air but still definitely with the precipitation it will feel like it's a very early spring like day but as we see that precipitation will move out friday evening we'll take clear skies overnight into saturday morning and allow for still a cooler feel most locations again falling to that freezing mark the good news is that starting the day off with uh, sunshine on saturday should allow temperatures to climb very quickly this time of the year that sun angle does a lot of work and we're looking at even hitting at least those mid 60s if not heading into those 70s it should be a gorgeous day winds generally on the lighter side up to maybe 25 miles per hour but that is definitely manageable but you can see the climb that is taken with those winds into monday and that's where our attention will be drawn for our next more impactful system that will also be associated with some precipitation as well as keeping our temperatures below normal